First tonight, the University of Rhode Island community is mourning the loss of a longtime staff member. Maureen McDermott, director of student involvement and the Memorial Union, died on Friday after she was hit by a car on campus earlier this month. Hannah Cotter is live over at URI for us. And Hannah, this is a difficult loss for people who actually knew and loved Maureen. Mike Shannon, people we spoke with say Maureen McDermott was genuine, kind, and a pillar here at URI, and she was also an advocate for students in the 40 plus years that she worked at the university. She was really, for me, the life of this building. I, I, like I said, I walked in this building yesterday and it, it felt kind of empty. Uh, it, it really did feel weird um, because she was just everywhere. The Memorial Student Union is quiet today as students, staff and members of the URI community begin to process the loss of Maureen McDermott. She was a real saint in the community. She was the sort of person who lifts everyone up around her. She would always have a smile on her face and she was just like such a like genuine and kind person. The university says McDermott died last week after she was hit by a car on campus earlier this month. McDermott was the director of student involvement and had worked at the university for over four decades, starting in 1981. She also served as an advisor to students. We caught up with several who worked alongside her as members of the campus radio station. She knew radio front to back and she would always have such a way about helping with things. She was always the type where she would make sure that you're being motivated properly and she would she would do everything in her power to help. She was one of the most organized people I know. She was one of the most passionate people I know um, and I knew I could always turn to her as a reliable source of information and she the most profound thing to me is she did it all with a smile on her face. A university spokesperson previously said the driver involved in the crash is a current student here at URI and that they're investigate their cooperating with the investigation, excuse me. It's unclear if that person will be facing any charges. Meantime, the university is offering counseling and other services for those that need them. We have more information on our website, WPRI.com. We're live from the campus of URI. I'm Hannah Cotter, 12 News.